Hello everyone, please welcome to my channel. Today I'm going to share with you E350 W22O. Today I'm going to change engine oil and oil filter. And let's get started. So these are the things I'm going to use. Jack, tools, and this is the oil I'm using it. 5W40 and the filter. It's a HU7025Z the filter the cap to remove the oil filter also the drain buckets i'll list the part numbers under the description in case you need it so first thing we're going to jack up the car After jacking up the car, now we're going to remove the skid plate. To remove it, we're going to use 8mm socket. If you have a drill, that's a perfect. So after removing 6 screws, now we're going to pull it down. And now we're going to remove this. After removing four screws, as you see, this one comes down, but there is another screw on the other side. After removing all the five screws, this one comes down. That's where is our oil pan. So we're going to open the drain bowl, which is a 13 millimeter socket. So we're going to get the drain bucket right underneath and we're going to remove the bowl. As you see, it started to drain out. The oil is very dirty. Now we're going to open the oil filter. So we're going to open the engine oil cap. As you see, the oil is still draining. Now we're going to bring the jack down so it can drain out fully. As you see, the jack is fully down. So we're going to wait. Once it's fully drained, then we're going to put the bolt back. We're going to remove the cover. So this is a 76 millimeter filter wrench cap. Now we're going to take out the filter and please make sure that the user rag so we won't drip the oil. As you see, there is no more dripping. So we're going to lift the car again. So we're going to put the bolt back and uh, also make sure that uh, you put the new copper washer on it. Every time you replace uh, engine oil, you always uh, replace the washer also. So we're going to tighten the bolt and uh, also we're going to clean up the area. If there is any oil residue, we're going to clean it. So make sure that uh, clean it. Once bolt is uh, torqued down and uh, we're going to put that, uh, the panels back and uh, make sure that uh, we put all the screws in. This is the dirty oil as you can see. Both plates 
place name and uh, we're going to title the school school. We're going to bring the jack down with the oil and we're also going to replace the filter. This is the filter I'm going to use. So it goes only one way, as you see, it locks in. So we're going to take out the O-ring. So when you put the new O-ring, make sure that uh, you lube it. And then put the new O-ring. We are ready to install the filter. So now we're going to put the filter back. So make sure that uh, we're going to do the hand tight and then we're going to use the wrench and we're going to give a quarter turn. So now we're going to do the quarter turn. That's it. And now we're going to pour the engine oil. So we're using 5W40. So we added the five part, now we're going to add uh, two more quarts. So we're done with the five part, we're going to add two more quarts. So all together, seven quarts. We're going to take out the funnel. Put the cap back. We're going to check uh, oil level. The oil level, it's full. We're going to put back the cover. We're going to drive the car. And then we're going to check the oil level again. So that's how it's easy and simple. Change your engine oil and oil filter on E350 W212. And if this video helped you out, like always, like, share, and subscribe to my channel. Thank you, and have a good day. Bye-bye.